Hey guys, welcome back to our repair guys. Today we will show you how to remove and replace windshield wiper motor on Mercedes E-Class, C-Class. Uh, this is a W208 2000 model, uh, CLK right here. And what we're actually going to do now, we'll open the hood all the way up. Let me show you how to do that quick if you haven't seen it in one of the videos. Okay, you need to go down a little bit, pull that thing to the back, push it all the way. And we can open it in service position. Now guys, we'll go ahead and remove that plastic cover right here, okay? And you need to press down, okay, on those things. It's a little bit tight, to be honest with you. Okay, like that. Perfect, it's three of them, three on this side, three on the other one. Okay, we have three screws that we will need to remove with a few of screwdriver here. All right, so kind of like warning together, guys, on some things. If you need to see links for tools or parts we use, guys, we will have those uploaded on our website, Mechanic Wipe Style. We usually use Amazon a lot, so. We'll, we'll definitely have them there. Okay, a fourth one right there, so all together four screws now. And let me go ahead and <laughs> get some tools. It's a big mess here. But we will need a 10 millimeter with extension or just a 10 millimeter wrench. Okay, one nut. That we will need to remove there. This is almost done. Not so easy to reach, but we got it out. Right where the windshield wiper is, we have two more. Few of screwdriver screws right here. So let's, do, let's take those things off. If there is an easier way, just let us know. We'll be glad to to know about it. Okay, this one's out. Awesome. The same procedure on this side. That cover. You push three clips down, pull it out, four screws. We got those loose already, so we can save you some time and don't watch this removing screws for about five minutes. Okay, just this one there. And we will have one more nut, the same kind of nut there. Okay, that's great. Now we will see how many clips we will need to remove. So we, we have a few clips we need to pry open here now. Okay, right here now. We got those out almost. Okay, let's see what else we need to do. This is just the seal here. Sometimes they come in two pieces just to make sure. So it's a really complicated procedure. You will have to remove all that piece here if you want to do it the right way. What we usually do, if you get a bigger screwdriver, you can pry it like that and get the other clips open here. There is a few clips behind it, but otherwise it's so much work. That's why they charge so much for windshield wiper molar, guys. And we'll just try to do it that way. We've done it in the past, it just, uh, you have to be careful not to break your plastic. That's one thing for sure. Because it is it is breakable. Okay, we have one more there. That's gonna come off. We we'll have one on the bottom there. I wish I could get the light in. Okay, maybe like that. 
All right, guys, you can see we got them out. Okay, I think we have only one more hole in here, yep. So now we can show you, okay, check out now where all the clips are. Okay, those are the hard to read clips. One, the two here, one, two, and these two right here. But that way, guys, as you can see, the windshield wiper motor is right here. I know it's a complicated deal, but otherwise you have to take all that stuff off. You have to disconnect vacuum hoses, heater holes, drain the coolant, all that stuff. And it just, it just too much work. And uh, now the motor is right here. Okay, we'll pull that thing out now. And we have a few nuts that we'll need to remove. So now with the 10 millimeter, Okay, one bolt there. We have one nut that we need to remove right here. All right guys, and then we have, uh, okay, not to drop the nut, you have to be careful. Ta -ha, almost, almost dropped it. And I guess we'll pull it out with the other piece here. We'll see if, if that works. It just fell in a bad spot now. Okay, one more there. Okay, so that's great. Now right here, guys, this one, you will need to disconnect it. Okay, and you, you lift it up. You might want to help it with a screwdriver if it's stuck. Okay, like that. Now we need to check the wires and see how those go. Uh, we'll need to pull them out. Okay, press in here. And we'll need to remove them. Okay, like that. And now let me get out for a second. And we'll be able to pull the whole assembly out. Now if you need to replace the motor only. Okay, all we have is this three bolts right here but you need to remove everything out to remove and replace the windshield wiper motor so thank you guys for watching please subscribe guys and see you next time